Hello, Jenny Hall here for Trinity Stamps. Today we're excited to be part of the expo and share some slimline Christmas cards with you. All of the projects will feature the slimline pattern paper pads. We're going to start off with sharing the hip to B square slimline die. This is a really nice slimline die that cuts little squares and creates like a frame. The outside measurements are eight and a half by three and a half inches. Here's a look at what the frame die cut appears to be. And you can use this die cut in lots of different ways. Here are the little squares that it cuts out, and you could even use these in some sort of a design. We're going to start off by creating a slimline card, and I'm using a piece of pattern paper here that has been trimmed down to eight and a half by three and a half inches, and I'm going to adhere that to a slimline note card. Once I have that in place, then I'll be able to adhere the frame. This frame is really great for also creating shaker cards. To do that, simply adhere a piece of acetate behind this die cut and then adhere with some foam strips around the edges and you have an instant shaker card. I'm adhering this window frame as I kind of feel that it looks like a window and I'm going to add some stamped elements. This is the From Our Gnome to Your stamp set, which is one of many of the gnomes that we carry in the Trinity store. I've already pre-colored and die cut all of the elements from this sweet little stamp set. And you can see here that our little girl gnome has a pretty flower. And the sentiment says, from our home gnome to yours. So you could choose to have the sentiment read out from our home to yours or from our gnome to yours. Or you could pair the sweet little gnome lady and use a different sentiment altogether. I'm going to show you what it looks like to use this sentiment that it comes with the stamp set and have it say from our home to yours. The thought behind this card is that it looks like a tall window and that there is some snowfall on the outside which is created by that pattern paper. This is the holiday pattern paper pad and it is full of nine by four double-sided papers. Now you can see here, it would be easy to swap out the home word for the gnome word, and it creates a sweet little card. Moving on, our next project is going to have some scripty dies. This is the Happy Holidays scripty die and the Sweet Holiday Wishes die set. I'm going to use some colored cardstock and cut this from brown paper. When I first had a look at this die, it reminded me of a chocolate bar. So we are going to recreate a chocolate bar and have a gift card holder on the inside. By using a few different products from the Trinity store, such as this coffee mug die set, this part has the gift holder that is really easy to die cut and just slip on the inside of any sized card. I've started out by using a slimline card base that once it's folded and scored, it measures eight and a half by three and a half. And then I've taken this die and made the die cut from the same colored cardstock. All of those little white squares are actually double-sided foam. I've taken all of the little pieces that come away from the die once it's die cut. We're going to call that the negative space. And I have added a little bit of brown ink to each one of those. That way it will stand out a little better from the base of the card. 
This type of card would be ideal for our older kids or for adults. It looks like a chocolate bar and will easily resonate with them. Now I'm going to use cut from silver foil paper that Happy Holidays scripty die and I've cut the S away from the end of the word to just say holiday. The Sweet Holiday Wishes stamp or die set, it has these perfect little matching greetings. It says sweet and wishes and it works out perfectly. Now just to adhere that gift card holder on the inside and you can see those little flaps where you slide in your gift card. And there you go. Really easy to make for anybody, especially for guys. We need lots of ideas for guys. I hope that these two projects have inspired you with your crafting this Christmas, either for gift card holders or just to make a nice slimline card to share. Thanks for watching this video. All of the products are linked in the video description below. I hope you have a great holiday season.